Alright, what's going on YouTube family? Today is July 30th. Today is the Lee Lebrotic Classic. So, if I did not move my show up two weeks, this is the show that I would have been doing, uh, which is today at 9 o'clock. So, it's 8.55 right now. I'm headed to the Lee Lebrotic Classic because Alfie is now sponsoring the event. We're the official like gym that's partnering up with the show. And so, we got a little section there. We're going to go say what's up to everybody and wish our athletes and our gym members good luck. And we have Russell competing today. He's doing bodybuilding, bodybuilding. He's doing bodybuilding, and um, I'm excited to go see him kill it. So that's what we're doing, and yeah, I'll see you guys there. It's just me, myself, and I this morning. In a good mood, listening to some country music. There's no clouds in the sky. It's beautiful, man. It's beautiful. Please don't fog up. Hope it doesn't fog up. What I'm rocking today, guys, for this event is for this competition. Got a All Saints and All Saints. Rocking an All Saints fishtail t shirt. Long in the back. It's nice and black. And then I'm also rocking these jeans that I just picked up that are a little bit too big for me. They're size 32. Um, check them out. They're like distressed, right? You can see that. But they actually have zippers at the bottom. So when you wear Chelsea boots, you can zip them up and it gives kind of like this cool look. And these are John Barbados uh, Chelsea boots in like a light tan color. Yeah, I'm excited for this show. It's my third show at this um, place. What up? How are you, man? You good? All right, bro. Hey, we'll see you in there, man. All right, I'm going to go support Russ and go check in and stuff. Yeah, All right? Yeah, he's already uh, in there. Perfect. The gym is literally right across the street from the Stafford Center. One thing I haven't said anywhere. Our Zenith line. Oh, look who it is. I'm actually the first one here. Thought I was supposed to be the late one, hey? You thought you were going to be the only one? I thought I was going to be the late one. No, it's only nine. You're good. I'm right on time? Yeah. Is anyone in there? Uh, I don't know. Matt's working the booth at nine. Okay, perfect. What's up, Hunter? How are you, bro? Yeah. You doing good? Good gym sick. You liked it? Yeah, I liked it a lot. I'm looking forward to going to train uh, legs today. We might be hitting legs today. Yeah. Maybe. Legs is going down. I'm going to let him do his thing. I'm going to let him do his thing. Hey, good to see you. Hey, good to see you. What are those, man? What are those, bro? God. We're talking about water weight. Okay, so Hunter won the overall the bodybuilding in the bodybuilding division at the branch. All right, you want to tell your story? Yeah, so uh, we're going to document my inner fat ass of this right now, right? <laughs> but um, so Friday night, weighed in for the branch at uh, 223, so made heavyweights by one pound. And then uh, Saturday night, after we won the overall, knocked out five eat glazed donuts in the hotel room, uh -huh. made a box of almond butter granola bars on the way to BJ's Brewery. Then did a uh, order of boneless wings, a deep dish buffalo chicken pizza, a chicken parmesan, and a pizookie trio. What was weigh in? Next day, did like sushi and two other meals out. Monday morning, I weighed 242 pounds. Whoa. <laughs> So you did 20 pounds. 20 pounds. Yeah, that's a lot for a day. I mean, that's where I'm at right now. Yeah, but. I, I, yeah it was. The man of the hour. Oh. What's up, sir? What's happening, bro? Hey, you know I've got a 700 gram carb Rice Krispie ready for you, man. Oh, for real? Yeah, yeah it's two yeah, pounds. Can you do it? Yeah, bro, it was, okay, so we're all chilling in the uh -huh. room, and then like, okay, two minutes bodyboarding. I was like. <laughs> what? Yeah. Right now? Well, well, no, before. Oh. We're chilling. Yeah, we, were, we already went. Oh, uh, yeah, you already yeah. went? Yeah, yeah. What? It happened so, yeah, it happened so fast, man. What, the, I didn't even see it? Yeah. It bro, I guess so I got here for, I got here 9 oh, Fucking hell, man. No, yeah, it, it was real fast, bro. Bro. It came out of nowhere. I feel like a very bad friend. No. No, no, no. I feel no, like shit. No, 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 it's all good, like. You're not going on again? Uh, 9 till night time. Oh, yes. my God. <laughs> you did I ever some 2K or anything? Man. I'm what telling you, I do? did Shaw tell you what I did to him? Yeah. I beat him like 30, bro. I got used yeah. to it. I got used to it. So. I'm down to flat. I mean, bro, it's, it's your day, man. We'll do whatever you want. No, I just want to eat. Sitting here. It's really good we got this backdrop. What's this from? Perfect, right? What's it from? This is from LA Fit Expo. Expo. They <laughs> sent us all of our stuff from Joe's dad made it for us. Really? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah, it's just Danae and I. Yeah, Danae and I are going to be the judges. Yeah, we're 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 going to be the judges. Yeah, we're
You don't really need Charlie. Look at this. Look at this. What's up? This is, this is Brandon, guys. Hi, uh, everyone. So, hey, Russell, bro. like, impromptu had to go on stage. Yes, he didn't get to pump up, but pretty much he didn't get to pump up, but the whole class didn't. But he got moved to the center, and he's between him and another guy. Russell said that his legs destroyed everyone in the class, and we know his upper body is crazy. So, we're looking for top two, and top two. we don't know, but... The other guy was leaner, Russ said? The guy, he said he was leaner than him, but Russell had more size for two. So, so what is she looking, looking at top two, but we'll see. God, but I wish Russell would have been able to pump up, man. Pump up, because that's when he gets leaner. Yeah, he, gets he looks that. leaner. He, he gets grainy. Yeah. 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 guys, I'll show you around real quick. This is our booth. Like I said, we're not selling product. We're just talking about the gym, and we have our Zenith line that is available to the public today at the gym, and we launch it tomorrow online. We got Whipped, which is these amazing cupcakes and cake balls, and they're super good. We got Nutrition, some clothing brands. Raw Gym, which is a new gym opening up. Magnum, the Texas Shredder. This actually, I did this competition two years. Those are my first two shows. The Drive Clothing, Glenn and Larry's Cookies. I see you. I see you. Oh my gosh, the white macadamia nut. And we're staying out. All right, uh, what's going on, guys? Right now, I am driving. This is probably really shaky. Uh, right now, I'm driving Shali's car, headed to the gym, and I'm gonna get a quick workout in. Pretty much did this morning at the. Or I went this morning to the classic, went to the warehouse, took care of some work, and honestly, I've been working on been working on website stuff for like three hours now. Um, just products, weights, descriptions, sizing charts, just all that kind of stuff, arranging things. There's a few errors coming up last minute that I'm glad I'm doing now and finding out now but really just you know, trying to take everything we've learned from previous launches, previous mistakes, and just being sure that everything is covered, like double checking, triple tra checking, quadruple checking, that everything is covered and we don't have mistakes. There's kind of a lot of pressure to be sure it's all good, but been dealing with it. I wasn't gonna work out, because honestly guys, the last few days I've been really stressed out. Product's been delayed and coming late, and we had two separate shipments, and I was like, you know what, I'm just gonna get through this launch, and then I will sort of reset myself and get back to my normal routine but then I remember that working out is my therapy and I'm going to get a quick session in. It's three o'clock now. We need to be back at the Labrada at 5.50 because we are not, the whole team, we are not missing Russell. <laughs> Tonight he does his individual posing. We're all gonna go and support him and it's gonna be a good time. A few adjustments I made on the website that I figured I would kind of talk to you guys. This is a quick business talk. We pretty much adjusted our pricing very slightly. So since the very beginning, we've always been like a 99 cent, you know, for example, 28.99, 32.99, 49.99. Uh, decided to get complete rid of one get completely rid of odd numbers so we're not doing like 49 we're not doing 37 or 35 we're only doing even numbers and we are doing no 99s or no 50, you know 50 cents or 99 cents so it's gonna be either like for example our performance charts have been 28.99 we dropped them down to $28 flat scoop next were 32.99 we put them at 32 flat uh, Zenith shirts we put at 42 flat we were going to do 44 or 46 but i decided the 42 was best to get them in your guys hands so you guys can feel them and understand the material the quality of them and we redid the website we got a new theme we've been working on that with joe uh something a lot more clean and i think that you guys are gonna like the website so go check it out i want to stay within our demographic and yeah um that's what's up so place some big orders for the future and i just hope you guys enjoy and like this and i know you will so that's the update i wish i could just say that i haven't been stressed out or haven't been dealing with stuff and it's been losing some sleep you know what i'm saying look at this beluga whale <laughs> <laughs> bro it's only from it's only from here that you look kind of chunky then my, no my face look at my face i know that's what i'm showing oh <laughs> Physique looks insane. Guys, Charlie's been thinking he's fat and like disgusting. He didn't even want to, he's gonna go buy a tank top to wear at the pool in LA because he feels he looks terrible. So tell him to shut up. I don't think on my face. You don't, it's genetic. For real? Yeah. What, you, you have any tips on how to make? You just gotta chew a lot of gum. Like, a lot. Yeah, bro, you gotta work, draw 10 sets of 10. 10 sets of 10, just. <laughs> bro, my face is getting all my like body fat and water and everything. Bro. Are you done working out already? Pretty much. Damn, I'm about to start. All right, so I'm family back at the commentary for y'all, and currently it is August 1st. I'm doing this voiceover, and I'm here in LA. I'm here from Monday, August 1st, until Monday, August. Am I here, Javon? Are we here until Sunday or Monday? Okay, I think Sunday. 
Is, and your event's Friday, Saturday only, right? Okay, so the YouTubers retreat is this coming weekend. Javon put it on. Javon has taken a risk, and I am in full support of this YouTube, YouTuber retreat movement. So the whole team's coming down. Uh, Heidi Summers. We've got Amanda Bucci. We've got Rob Lips. Rob Lipset. We've got... <laughs> that's so bad. <laughs> Who else? Run Emily Hayden. They probably can't hear you. Sophia, German YouTuber. Travi coming down. Just a bunch of people. And it's going to be Max Tuning's coming down. Damn, I almost forgot Max. He's coming down tomorrow. Um, but anyway, my point is there's a bunch of people coming down um, this entire week. Uh, I'm going to be filming with a lot of people, just hanging out with people, having a great time in L.A. And I'm going to be vlogging every single day. So I'm thinking I'm going to do like a video a day and just pump out a bunch of content. Uh, I'm staying by myself in my hotel, so like, I feel like I haven't had much alone time uh, just with the launch and being super busy and the prep and everything, and so I'm excited to kind of like chill and uh, hang out for a few days, get some business, meeting do business meetings done here earlier in the week, and then do the YouTubers retreat this weekend. So yeah, really excited about it. That's a quick update. Now, to get to this workout, started out with the bench press, did sets of, I want to say... <coughs> Also, I'm coughing a lot. I think that, man, I don't even feel like talking about the workout. I feel like I'm just gonna update you guys. But I feel like I'm coughing so much because in Houston, it's super humid and like damp and everything. And then coming to California, it's a lot drier. And I literally feel like my throat dried up. That may sound stupid, maybe I'm just getting sick or whatever, but I feel like that's why. Because I felt perfectly fine in Houston. As soon as I landed in LA, it just changed, but I'm coughing a bunch. Anyway. Now back to the workout and try this again. Uh, flat bench press and then moved on to, let me see, let me see, let me see, the pec deck. So with the flat bench, I decided to do 225 pounds for sets of 12. Uh, I wanted to hit four sets of 12 and I didn't have too long to work out. I only had about an hour and so I kept my rest times a little bit shorter on the bench. Normally I'll do anywhere from you know two to four minutes rest time. I was only doing about a minute to a minute and a half rest time hitting sets of 12. Uh, followed by the pec deck fly or the pec fly. Uh, machine really focusing on pulling my elbows. So even though my arms are up, my hands are grabbing the bars. I'm trying to bring my elbows together and get a good contraction in my chest as well as a stretch. Third movement, tricep push down with a straight bar. Fourth movement, which we're on, is so, da, 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 where we at? Where we at? Where we at? A tricep push down with the rope. Not sure why I did two push downs in a row, but I did. And then moved on to a decline hammer strength press, which I never, I don't do that that often. Normally I would do like an incline dumbbell or an incline hammer, but just felt like changing it up today and hitting the decline. I'm really excited to just like be able to, I'm, right now I'm like forming the split in the routine and the, the movements that I'm going to be doing. And then I like, you know, being in the surplus because of course I keep my staples in there, but for my accessories, I like to change it up, have fun. Uh, manipulate my rest times, my supersets, my exercises, and it keeps it interesting for me. So uh, I'm really excited for the next few months to not only get stronger, to get bigger, um, but to enjoy my training. And you know, when you're dieting down, a lot of times you try to you know, keep the same movements, be sure you're not losing strength, be sure you're using, losing minimal strength, and you have a little bit more flexibility in your surplus, obviously. So very excited about that. But anyway, that's going to conclude this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you this weekend in L.A. I'll be in L.A. all week just hanging out, business meetings, hanging out with people, <coughs> recording with people, and having a good time. So, yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video, which will be up very, very soon. So stay tuned. Also, thank you for the awesome launch. You guys are awesome. I love you. Bye.
Pine! Woo! Fuck yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Seven Ha, ha, ha.